In today's video, we're going to be uh, talking a little bit about uh, how and why you should clean your computer and uh, certain ways that uh, do work and certain ways that uh, don't work. I'm sure you've seen, you know, uh, the kids and whatnot getting the compressed air in these little these little baby cans of compressed air. <laughs> yeah, how about no? I'm going to show you the real way to do it and. Uh, the reason why you need one tool and one tool only if you buy it once you live in an apartment you're going to use it many many times so uh, you can get a cheap one and you'll still be uh, well ahead of the game if you get these little baby cans of air that well <laughs> you're paying for the can and you know air is free so uh, whatever this one is disgusting i am way overdue for a proper cleaning and uh, i'm going to show you uh, i'm going to show you how i do it and how I recommend that all of you guys do it as well. So let me set up here real quick and we're gonna get into it. All right, you gots to get yourself one of these. I mean, I don't care who makes it. Just, uh, you know, get something that's about three gallons worth. You know, the bigger the better, the bigger the tank, the, the, the more run time you'll have. Uh, also, the longer it, the, the pump's gonna run to fill that tank, but you got more you got more work and uh, working power with a bigger tank this is a little three gallon ain't nothing special and snap one does not make it they just put their logo on it uh i forget who makes this i did look it up once upon a time but uh you need a real air compressor that's a real can of air right there and then you just need yourself a blowgun this is one of those uh uh harbor harbor freight versions uh, i've been very happy with it it's got uh, it's a high volume it's got extendable sticks and whatnot and so I mean that's uh, really the the name of the game here air compressor blow gun and yeah, <laughs> get yourself a real can of air you know what I mean all right I'm gonna put uh, put you guys on a uh, tripod and yeah we're gonna see what comes out of this thing I'm betting it's gonna be real nasty alrighty um, this is gonna be hundred and twenty five pounds of air pressure Gonna make uh, a little bit of noise, so uh, yeah, bear with me here. should try to stop these from ramping up too bad um, you can do bearing damage just put your finger over you know over the fan and get in there and whoops careful careful <laughs> hold the fan steady while uh, giving her the beam Don't forget the back side of the motherboard and the, well, this uh, opposite side of the case because that traps a whole bunch of crap too. Now don't forget the underside where uh, your power supply filters is normally located because uh, they get real nasty too. Presto.
make sure you blow out your graphics card real good in both directions from the inside out outside in you know really uh, be as thorough as you can because uh, you're already here right and any unused ports blow them out alrighty then um, five minutes of uh, Hot air, cold air, whatever you got laying around, you know what I mean? A proper can of air. <laughs> and uh, yeah, take a look. That's all I used. So, uh, you know, get yourself an air compressor if you don't have one. Seriously, you need one. <laughs> You're really missing something out of your life. So, uh, you know, this was just a uh, quick and dirty, short and sweet. Uh, update here I haven't done a video on this channel in a while because I've been very very busy on my new channel which I'm going to talk about in an upcoming video but uh, whatever I got things and stuff that are in the works so I'm going to try and maintain both channels as best I can but uh, in the meantime hey cheers <laughs> thanks for hanging out